Why did it stop the second I looked behind me? Hey clowns, what's going on and welcome back to another video. So in today's video, me and Nemo, we got another examination for you. Similar to how a couple videos ago we played assessment examination and we had to decide whether we want to trust people or not based on how they looked. In this one, we have to decide whether what we're shown is scary or not. So I'm sure there's going to be a twist to this. It's obviously not going to be a normal test because that, that, that just wouldn't be fun. Then we're just in school. We're going to hop in. We're going to see what happens. Let's jump right in. Now, the way this game is framed is very weird, so it might change as the video goes on, but here we go. Examination of fear. I am Daniel Salo. I am your examiner for this exam. But before I give you your papers, I will ask you a few questions. I am going to show you a few images. They might give you an uneasy or weird feeling. Tell me honestly if you got that feeling or not. This will decide if you are eligible for the examination or not. A man's got a glitchy voice. So we have to decide if they make us uncomfortable. Starting image protocol. Um, I would say that's... Clowns definitely creep me out, even though I'm one of them. They definitely, definitely very creepy looking, so I'm gonna say scary. Uh, is that... I guess that's like a ghost woman? That's not scary to me. Doesn't look scary. Okay, that looks like a bug monster. I'm not a big fan of bugs, especially spiders. So that's, that's definitely, yeah, it's going to go on the scary list for me. I, I just said I don't like spiders game. Why? Yeah, that's, yeah, scary. Worms? Again, all all kind of bug, insects, anything kind of freak me out a little bit, but I would not be scared of, like, a worm. Shark, yeah, sharks, sharks are pretty scary, especially that one. That one's definitely, uh, not no ordinary shark. Looks like some business people in a meeting. Okay. I don't even know what that is. I, I have no idea what that is. That's, I'm going to say not scary. Okay. It's definitely creepy, but mm, not really, not, not really scary to me. Not scary. It's a tree. Hands coming out of the wall. Creepy. Uh, not really that scary, though. Now, I'd be pretty scared if I encountered that thing. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not a fan of something with teeth like that. That looks almost like it's the same thing. So I'm going to say scary. Why did it stop the second I looked behind me? That wasn't creepy at all. Uh, this thing doesn't really... I mean, yeah, it's a little scary, but... Mm. This reminds me of, like, the Ninetales from Naruto or something. When he gets into that Ninetales form. So, I'm gonna say not scary. <laughs> That's the first thing I thought of. Ooh. That face does make me a little bit uncomfortable. I do have to admit. So I'm gonna go scary for that one. Him. Me. Whatever this thing is, it doesn't look human. It's only got, it doesn't have legs. And its arms are very long. Okay. It does make me a little uncomfortable, I have to admit. So I'm gonna say scary. Yes, yeah, scary. It 
The game's getting louder, like that background noise is getting louder. Uh, yeah, that's making me, yeah, it's making me a little uncomfortable. I'm gonna go scary again. Running won't work, play dead. I right, got you. Oh, that thing's terrifying. The void, the black void, horrifying. No, obviously not scary. Don't smile at me like that. Don't do that. Great. We will be discussing your results with our company and decide if you are eligible or not. If you are selected, you will be called on your number. Looking forward on seeing you very soon. Is that it? Oh. That evening, he went home happily, expecting a job and an easy life ahead. But his happiness was only temporary, because when he entered his house, he saw him, staring at him. He ran as fast as he could in the woods, but he was no match for him. He was caught. Now he is imprisoned, and his reality is lost forever. Expecting to see you very soon. Your examination has now come to an end and you can leave now. All right. So it sounded like that thing at the end was talking about me, because it said he went home happy thinking he was going to get a job, but then when he walked inside, he saw him. Now, something that I have not told you guys is that I know that this game has two endings. It was in the description that it has two endings, so we're going to try to go for the second ending. <sighs> okay, so in between when you last saw me and right now, it's been almost 30 minutes. <laughs> I tried playing this game over and over and over to try to get the second ending, which is very, very, very slightly different. Basically, it just doesn't show that little cutscene at the end where it says like, oh, uh, he went home and he was happy, blah, blah, blah. It doesn't show that, and instead the examiner tells you, oh, great job, you're not even afraid of the alternates, please step in the chamber to your right. It's basically the only difference in the ending. I tried everything to get it. I tried saying that everything was scary. I tried saying everything was not scary. And I even looked up someone who got the good ending, copied all of their answers and still didn't get it. So I don't know if you have to wait on certain questions for long enough, or I don't know what the specifics are of it, but guys, I, I really tried and I just, I couldn't get it. I'm sorry. Look, I even, I, I even made a list of what the person that got the good ending wrote down and I, I still I still couldn't get it so <laughs> but yeah it's only a very slight difference uh this game was cool I love analog horror games like this that are like a test or something it's so creepy and unnerving and definitely very different from the usual regular horror style games so I love when games like this come out if you guys know any other games like this please feel free to recommend them to me also I want to give a big shout out to my YouTube members thank you guys so much for the support you guys are incredible also if you're not subscribed go hit the sub button you could always change your mind later and like the video if you enjoyed. And alright guys, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.